it's obviously he's got some problems, whether it be with the darts or his setup, his practice. He's lost an awful lot of weight. And, you know, when you get to our age, when you lose weight, you can't just strictly lose weight. You've got to put a little bit of muscle on. He's lost a lot of weight around the arms. It's a different throw. He's just got to get used to it. But in the Premier League, week in, week out, you don't get a breather. It ain't as if you're going to get an easier draw. He's just got to get through it, and he's got to start playing a lot more tour events to get that edge back. But that's just my opinion. Which we're always welcome with us, Rodney. Always a pleasure to hear your views. Now, Lewis against Newton. Fourth match of the night. Phil Taylor still averaged 101. Five of the six players tonight have averaged over 100. The odd man out, poor old Gary Anderson, up in the high 90s. So in terms of quality of darts, we've never seen better in a Premier League night. Adrian Lewis and Wesley looking to save it up again in match four. Aye, aye, another one. Would have left tops. Good start, though, from the Fleetwood Flinger. Yes, I agree. I, I can't remember a Premier League night that has started with the performance and the averages that these players are, are stepping up and doing at the moment. It really is incredible. I think it, it, it's showing that week in, week out, year on year, that the players are getting closer and closer. As Wes Newton fires in the first 14 dart leg for Newton. And that's what he's got to do against AD. He's got to take the game to Lewis. Well, last year, Wesley Newton finished in one of the two uh, elimination spots. He picked up five points, two wins only. One of those was against Adrian Lewis, though. One so they have previous, but it was an house of sorts campaign from Lewis. He only finished eighth in the ten-man table. He was bottom, actually, in the, in the second segment, if you like. Bottom of the remaining eight. He's really picked up his game this year. Talking of picking up his game. Well, if you're going to hit 180s, hit it against the throw. That puts the pressure on your opponent. It's a great return from Lewis. But Wes, possibly going to get six darts from here. And that treble one is not going to help. So it opens the door up for Adrian Lewis to set this up and take it out. Here. 21. Where's your requirement? Well, the old 138 rears its head again. And uh, Newton looking for the two leg advantage with the break of throw. Won't be going out. Treble. Oh, never up, never in, Wesley. Yes, he let Lewis off there. Lewis will know he's, he's going to get one dart at the double, 16. possibly tops. Well, six starts without a treble from AD, so making it quite easy for Newton to break the throw. Lovely dart. Double 12, lovely finish. Well, an ordinary start from Adrian Lewis. An extraordinary start from Wes Newton, who's averaging 107, and he's taking the first two legs. Now throwing for a three-leg advantage. Amazing what one win will do, Rod, isn't it? Last week, he had that good win against Barney. Trailing for much of the match, really dug in and pulled off a big win, and he looks a different bloke, Wes Newton. I totally agree with you. I mean, he was 5-1, 5-2 uh, down, you thought, game over, and, and that's it. But he's he's taken this game straight off of what he did last Thursday against Barney. And uh, he's in there again, and then second 180 of the night. And who would think that Lewis would be outgunned on the treble 20? It's a little bit like the first match with uh, Anderson and Thornton. We all thought that Anderson had that scoring power, but it was Thornton. Eight maximums tonight for Robert Thornton. He beat Gary Anderson 7-2. MVG beat Dave, uh, Dave Chisnell 7-4. And Peter Wright defeating Phil Taylor with a similar scoreline. Still to come, RBB and the Wizard, Simon Whitlock. That's wow. more like it from Adrian Lewis. But still half a dozen darts for Wes Newton from 139. Well, he's going to have to switch. He's got to come back up to those 20s. He needs the treble to really put the pressure on. Oh, that should give him one dart at double top when he returns. And all AD can do is try to put some pressure on. And this, this extra pressure that's on AD here, he, you can see him shaking his head. He's having to count up, make sure he leaves a shot. 
he's making it quite easy for Wes Newton at the moment. Well, big 20, well away from that treble for tops. Lewis isn't going to get a poke from there, so Wes Newton's got another three. Well, Aidy did this in the, the second leg, threw bad darts at the wrong time, and he's let Newton in for a 3-0. Well, that is a mile away, that's got to have slipped out of his hand. And he comes down a double 16, and double 16 he hits! What a great dart that was, Rod, especially after the five. Yeah, horror story to start the visit, and then a delightful double, a terrific treble, three of them from Jampop. Finally woken up. Morning, Adrian. Here we go. Yes, this is what they've come to see. Incredible darts from these two players. Oh, and that's a bounce out and on the floor. Yeah, these two are carrying on, as we can see that. They actually deflect off the flight. They're carrying on from the previous games. Well, I remember at the Grand Slam a couple of years back when Adrian Lewis had a 10 dart leg against Phil Taylor, which Pretty featured a, a bounce out. He's been unlucky here, hasn't he? He might be able to replicate it, not this time. 93. Important thing for Lewis, though, Rod, it, never mind the nine darter, it, it's just hitting a double and winning a leg. You're exactly right, the, the nine darts are relevant, only that it wins the leg. And he's going to get possibly well. He is going to get six starts from here. Doesn't want to mess it up. He's been he's done it already in two legs where he's not hit a treble, and he's opened the door for the new. Again, he hasn't hit the treble. Not so bad this time. He will get two darts at a double. To break the duck. One point last week, Adrian Lewis was threatening to whitewash Phil Taylor. He was five nothing up. Fifty-four. At the moment, he's trying to make sure that that O does go by his name. Tops. Not gone yet. Which should require 164. This would be the shot of all shots for Wes Newton. Treble 20. Oh, and there's that five again. He's had a few of them tonight. The rest of the darts have been pretty tidy. So Lewis is going to come back now, Rollers. He doesn't want to put this inside. If he's going to miss, he doesn't want it inside. Dock breaking double ten for Adrian Lewis. Only a holder throw, mind you. So Newton still has the break in the back pocket. Forty-two. What Wes doesn't want to do is let Lewis get onto the power scoring. He's got to keep at him. He's got to keep in front of him. That'll put the pressure on Lewis and. Uh, you know, the 180s become 140s, the 140s are then tons. And that's where Newton well, Fred, can take this game more. from here. This is more like it. Well, I'm right I'm but he expected to fill the lot up once he'd put the two opening darts in the right spot. Averaging 91 tonight, A.D. Lewis in the previous two games, averaged well, a couple of ticks under 100 against Whitlock and just over 100 against Phil Taylor, so the low par. So now having to produce 58. some real hard graft. And usually we're used to seeing his darting artistry. Well, again, a visit without a treble from Adrian Lewis. And Wes Newton absolutely punished him for it. And the turn you feel is not enough, so Wes is going to get at least a dart at the bullseye. Maybe double five. Oh, and there's the five again. What a time to miss it. Could have been a 4 1 lead if Lewis takes this out. Maybe the treble 16 would have left tops. So a reprieve for Wes Newton. Wes should require 58 picked up five itis from somewhere in the last few legs now tops 18 
Is that the bit of luck that Lewis needs to just get on a run? First up finds the double 12. He's got it back to one leg. And Lewis with the throw. So now perhaps a little bit of the panic's over. Perhaps not. Funny old game this. After all the stratospheric scoring. 59. And high altitude averages of the previous three games. We're in the middle of a dogfight here between Lewis and Newton. 93. Well, at the moment, it, the winner's going to have to win this ugly. And certainly, Newton fills it up for his fourth maximum of the match. Pretty to watch. 26. Ugly stuff from Adrian, though. Last TV meeting was last year. Lewis speak Newton 9 8 in the UK Open. Newton had a nine dart leg. 96. Looking at a dozen dart leg here, Wesley. Well, doesn't need to go 17. If he would have gone for the ball, we'll never know. He's looking at double eight. Well, Aidy's made it very easy for Newton to break his throw here. Too many visits without a treble, and then when he does it a treble, it's a scruffy score of 81 or 85. There's a lot of work for Adrian Lewis to do. As well as Newton makes it four legs to two. That's the break of throw that he was looking for. This wow. really underlining the fact that you cannot nod off on any given week in the Premier League. Resounding win over Phil Taylor Nine last week, but if you turn up the week after against a player ranked far lower than the power and don't turn up with your at least your A minus game, Nine you get your backsides back. Yes, it seems that way. That's how it should be, Rod, isn't it? Exactly. That's what the game grows and that's what professionalism is all about. The more money and the more TV it comes into the game, the more people that want to play it, that ups the standard. And the players that are not doing it, there's a little bit of a wave goodbye, to be quite honest. Lewis looking to find something. Just one match tonight from Jackpot, four from West Newton. to move on to four points after three weeks which will give him a four-point cushion on Phil Taylor for a start and at the moment four points on Simon Whitlock he'll play later against Raymond Van Barnabell well again Lewis has not put any pressure and mind you as I said that Wes has gone and hit that five again I think that's the fourth really bad five he's hit that leaves a bullseye Robert Thornton managed two bullseyes the bullseye will be the route for Adrian Lewis. Now, triple 20 for double top, and he's not going to do that. 65. Wade should require 25. Two darts, a double here for West Newton to go three clear again. Double eight. Is it all aboard the Fleetwood Flyer? Game show. You bet it is. Flag. West Newton, I think, I need to pull first. Five, two. To Wes Newton against the two time former world champion Adrian Lewis, who is out of sorts. 41. Well, I don't think Wes will ever get a better chance of beating Lady. It's making it quite easy for Wes, and Wes is doing a real good job 96. doing what he has to do at the right times. Well, the world championships, Adrian Lewis just couldn't find a double against Michael Van Gerwen. We saw him in that match gradually just wither away. He just couldn't get in. And today, similarly, Roddy, just can't get anything going, Adrian Lewis, at all. Well, as West puts in his fifth maximum. Don't 
you find though, Rod, that the, the prolific scorers, the raw talent as we call it, do have these matches quite often. You know, they can't find it and it's very hard for them to, to then start finding it in the middle of a match, especially when Wes is doing, as you say, three darts here from Wes and um, could be all over. Well, he's three darts away from at least picking up a point here, Wes Newton. 97. Good night's work Where's here in Northern Ireland from the man from Fleetwood. Lovely dart. 89. Well, it's not a complete catastrophe because it leaves 78. Big 14. Second time he's hit 134 to leave tops in the match. That is, but it may be in vain. Because the double 12 guarantees Wes Newton, now it's the double six. The double Can six it is, guarantees Wes West Newton. Center. One Michael point West here West this West evening West at the Odyssey. On. In front of a capacity crowd, and I have to say the atmosphere is electric. Yeah, real darting feel good factor here wow. in Belfast. Wow. They're lapping it up. And Wes Newton is lapping this up, he's run off three straight legs. If he can pick up one of the next four, he'll pick up the points. We'll leave Michael Van Gerwen out on his own at the top. MBG winning for the third straight match tonight. That is a sick maximum. We saw eight from Robert Thornton. We saw seven from David Chisnell. Well, this is certainly where Wes Newton has improved his game. And he's given the chances, he takes them. When he has to close a match out, wow, this is exactly 20, what you've got to do with the throw as well. 58 after nine. These incredible darts. Wow, Excellent. Professional West performance from Wes Newton. Not in the Premier League to make up the numbers. Double ten for a second straight win. He will be back. Yes. And again. He's gonna set it up like he did the previous well, leg. Hit 134, well, now he's hit 131. Double ten. five for Newton. Game and West Newton Kane's in here though. It's seven legs to two and makes it back-to-back -back wins in the 2014 Premier League. West Newton is not here to make up the numbers. He's sniffing a playoff spot. The Fleetwood Flyer. Too good for Jackpot.